welcome back to my channel i hope you're all doing well um today i've got another update for my five by fall project this is the first update that i've got for you guys um i've got some interesting changes that are happening but uh let's just take a look at it so first of all the perfume that i've been working on is this yves saint laurent uh, perfume in Montparis and I've made a little bit of progress on it it's getting a little bit lower which you can see better in the close-up it's so hard to hold it still for the close-up though so you won't see it being very steady but I try it um, use this pretty much every day I went on holidays for a few days I did not bring this one with me but I brought something else in like a little travelo thingy um, so I didn't make as much progress on it as I could have I've forgotten to put this on a few days as well, which is kind of strange for me because normally I wear perfume every day, but I noticed that the last like weeks I sometimes forgot to put on perfume at all. I don't know what happened there, but anyway. Um, so I've made some nice progress on it and I think if I keep going, it might be three updates, but because I haven't used it for at least a week, it might be three updates as well. No, what did I say? It might be two updates as well before I have this one done, so we'll see. Um, I love it. It's really, really nice wearing it right now as well. It's kind of sweet, but also warm and grown up. So it's a grown up type of sweets, not the, the candy type of sweet, I guess. Even though when you're grown up, you can still wear candy perfumes as well, of course. So yeah, I really, really like this one. Um, then next we've got the bourgeois healthy mix powder that i'm working on can't really open this one for you because it is starting to fall apart you will see in the close-up i've used this and how i'm using this at the moment is i just kind of crush up little chunks of it so it becomes a loose powder and then i'm picking up that loose powder and using that on my face so it is moving um but it's a little bit harder to compare it to the last time because back then it was still kind of together and now it's not but yeah, we're moving and I still have hope that I will have this one finished by the finale. There is not that much left anymore. Then we have the Too Faced blush that is in my glamour to go palette. And this one is also moving along nicely. Um, there is a good bit of pan, as you can see with a close-up. You can even see better that I've hit side pan on this one on this side. Only a little bit, but there is like a teeny tiny strip of blush still on the side there, which is barely existent. So that is gonna be gone probably in like a few days so really happy about that so that will mean that i will mainly have to work on this side still it's getting fairly flat on that side already as well you can kind of see the pan there as well so or at least you can see the little ridges showing through so i feel like i should be able to finish this one off as well by the finale please please okay then we're moving on to lip products the first lip product was this Clinique lip uh, stick pop lipstick in papaya pop which is kind of an orangey corally color and I'm wearing it on my lips right now as well um, I do like this one although there might be a little bit too much glitter in here if I keep reapplying it during the day I feel like it becomes a little bit too glittery on my lips but as long as I keep that in mind it's fine um, I've made some nice progress on it I've used it for um, a week straight at least over the last three weeks so that is how I managed to at least make some progress on it happy about that so that is that one also for that one I think I should be able to finish it off before the finale two three updates and then it should be gone then like I said interesting changes I had that shimmering lip gloss from pure perfect that I promised you guys I would make progress on every single time if you can still remember that was the promise that I made in my last video and guys I'm promising you i'm gonna be focusing on this you're gonna be seeing progress every single time i update you guys and now i tried to actually do that the monday after i filmed that over the weekend i put it in my pocket of my jacket and i went to work when i got at work it was not in the pocket of my jacket anymore so i lost it it just dropped out of my pocket while i was cycling to work so that was a bit of a shame because I was really planning to work on it um, and I didn't manage to do that because it's gone. I don't know where it is, it's, it, it ended up somewhere on the street. So what I've decided to do instead is just go with another lip product. Um, I told you that this would be showing up soon. This is the uh, Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Lip Balm Stain. 
or something along those lines in charm it still is in my roulette pan collab or not mine in the roulette pan collab um project at the moment um but that's only going for a month and this project will be going for longer so i'm double dipping for a little bit but i do want to keep working on this one once that project is gone so i thought i'd just fit it in here because this will be going for another month almost month and a half uh, by the time that one is done so what where i'm at right now and i'm actually filming this on the same day as i filmed that roulette pan collab um the knob is just not showing anymore at the top that's where we're at but we've still got about like that much left to work on which i'm going to be doing over the next month for the roulette pan collab but also in the meantime i'm going to be working on this one for this project so yeah, that is what I'm gonna be doing. Don't normally like double dipping, but I think for this one it kind of works out. Might not show you this one in my next update because it will be before the finale of the project roulette because I do this one every three weeks and the roulette pan collab one is every month. Um, so I kind of have to think about what I wanna do with that. But anyway, um, I will think about that. You guys don't have to watch me um, talk about me thinking about that. Let, let's just stop talking thank you guys very much for watching this video um like i said i have hopes that i will be able to finish off most of the projects by the finale but at the same time i think they're going to be in here for at least two three more updates so let's see that is it for today though thanks for watching and i hope to see you in my next video Bye bye